As a six-year-old, when you start playing, they never tell you that they will measure you with your success. The championships, the trophies, you just have to win, and that is the holy grail to all competitive sports. You know, when we're playing chess, when we're playing a game, based on our understanding of the game and on our skill level, we have only so many resources on the board. We have our pieces and we have to decide where we want to place them, how we want to play and how we want to move forward uh, in the game. That's our quest for the best in trying to get the position that we want. And I think that can translate into life as well, where you don't let the outside world decide for you what you want to do or what you want to become or your journey for you. I think it has to be you who has to make up your mind, how you want to shape your life, how you want to shape your journey. And then whenever you might have challenges or an opposition, you think to yourself that, will this action really contribute? Chess is a solitary sport. You're not only playing against your opponent, but also against yourself every day. Your emotions, your nerves, your psychology. When you're playing a game, it doesn't matter if you've made 40 good moves. Just one slip, one mistake, you lose your focus and it's all over. In chess, you're only as good as your last win, you're only as good as your last game. I remember the Commonwealth Championship, it was the very first game and I was winning throughout. At the very end, in time trouble, I lost my nerves, I lost my cool, blundered and lost that game. It was a disastrous start, a big tournament upset. And at that moment, had someone come to me and told me that I was going to go on to win the championship, I would have laughed it off. It led to a long, sleepless night, but I had to go back up the next day to play my game and fighting all doubts on the board as well as internally, mentally. I, it was very, very difficult. It was, uh, it was I think, one of, the, uh, one of the more difficult moments in my chess career. But eight days later, I was fighting for the championship. And I think that was a big reminder to me that it's really not about the difficult days or losses, but about just getting back up there again. It's about never giving up and fighting it out. Despite having a bad start, you can't give up on yourself. And that's not something that anyone around you can convince you of. You have to find that within yourself. You have to find that noise within you. For me, that's my constant journey. A journey to be the best version of myself. To be better, to be stronger from one game to the next. And that for me is my quest for the best.